probably have heard in the Bible, the land of Cana. The Canaanites were Phoenician, Phoenician bloodline. And in the ancient Phoenician language, Cana meant merchant banker. The very word merchant comes from mer, M-E-R, for the sea, for water. As a mermaid, we have merchant. Merchant bankers. Let me give an example of the difference between the law of water and the law of the land. The Statue of Liberty must be put in water. It could not be put on American land as such. It had to be put in a harbor because it's not the Statue of Freedom. It's a Statue of Liberty. Liberty is what a sailor gets when he pulls into port on a ship. He gets liberty. He's not free. So America is not the land of the free and the home of the brave. We're not free or brave, period. And make no mistake, they do not pick words by chance. These words are very serious. Now let me give you an example of how this law of the water works. Why is it that you have to go to court? You go to court because you play basketball and tennis on a court. How do you play tennis on a court? You play with a racket. Why? Because that's what it is. It's a racket. When you go into a court, what's the idea of going to court? It's a game, like basketball. The whole idea in a court, uh, one team gets up and they throw the ball over to that team of lawyers. That team gets up and throws the ball back into their court. And the judge is wearing a black robe, so he is the referee. He doesn't care which side wins or loses because he's going to get paid anyway. So he couldn't care less. The judge is a, is a referee between two teams. The judge rules from the bench. The word bench in Latin is a bank. Therefore, the judge rules for the bank. Where do you find banks? You find banks on both sides of a river. They're called river banks. And what does a river bank do? It directs the flow of the current sea. Consequently, your money is current sea because it's the flow, the cash flow. I'll give you an example of how this works. When a ship pulls into a harbor, all ships are referred to as female. Why? There's a very good reason. Maritime Admiralty Banking Law says all ships are female because they're carrying items for money, and so consequently they are under Maritime Admiralty Law. Admiralty is where we get the word admiral, admiral of the Navy.